When writing notation on the staff, it's important to be very specific with your calligraphy. Note heads are specifically ovals and not perfect circles. You also want to make sure that you're writing specifically a space note or a line note, and I'd like to show you how to do that now. When writing a space note, make sure that the note head only occupies the space of the pitch you're notating. For instance, if I were to write a note head in the first space, it would look like this. If I were to write a space note on each space on the staff, it would look like this. Again, notice I'm being really mindful not to overlap my note head into an adjacent line. So I'm not doing this. Because remember, each line and each space represents a different pitch. And you want the reader to be able to read clearly which pitch you intend for them to play. The same is true for line notes. If I'm writing a line note on the staff, it's important that the line slices directly through the center of the note head. I'll write a line note on line one. So I'm trying to position the note head so that the line is slicing through the center of the note head itself. I'll write a note head on each line on the staff. So here's line two, line three, line four, and line five. You want to make sure that your note head is only occupying that specific line and not overlapping into other spaces nearby. So we wouldn't write a note head like this. That's unreadable because that note head is touching the first space, the second line, the second space, and it's hard to tell which pitch that would actually be. So be really careful and really detailed as you start to learn how to write notation. It's important that you practice this skill with an actual pencil and staff paper. Music calligraphy is a very specific skill set that requires practice similar to how you would practice an instrument. Remember that it may take you some time to master this skill, but every musician should know how to notate correctly on the staff to communicate effectively with other musicians. Thank you.